Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today's video I am filming a video about my own little skincare business. I've got my water with me. This is actually a new bottle. Might feature it in my January favourites because I do really like this but yeah I might be taking a few sips of this so hopefully my lipstick doesn't run down my face. Oh and do you like these little guys? Doesn't that look cute? It's like a lava lamp thing. I don't know why, I just liked it. Today I'm going to be talking to you about my products that I currently have on my Etsy and eBay which is where I sell my skincare products. So if you didn't already know I do have a little skincare business. It's called Fresh Faced by Georgie Carr and basically I make and sell my own skincare products. I make the products, I buy the packaging, I design the labels and post everything, make the orders etc. Um, do all of that so it is my little thing. I've already made sales this year and I've been posting orders as soon as I've been obviously receiving them and I have actually like pre-made some products so that I can be really quick. But if you was interested, my Etsy and eBay will both be linked in the description box. If you want to go and check them out, I do get a lot more sales on eBay. I don't know whether eBay's like just pushes my products out more to people or I just have like more repeat customers on there. I don't really understand. Or I don't know, is it hard to grow on Etsy? Um, just let me know if you sell on eBay, eBay and Etsy and how you find like your experience with that. I have a box of my products that I'm now gonna go through and show you each one. So product number one that I currently make and sell on my Etsy is this. This is my charcoal clay face mask and it is exactly what I just read out. It is a charcoal face mask. I wanted to make products that I would personally use myself. This is the kind of product that I gravitate towards because of my skin type. I have oily skin. I was gonna say pr spot prone skin, but it isn't really that spot prone. I do occasionally get spots, but if I'm consistent with my skincare routine and I do do face masks regularly, I don't tend to get them as much. But this is the kind of face mask that I genuinely like love. Clay face masks in general are like my favorite thing, but charcoal is such an amazing ingredient for your skin, especially if you do have oily spot prone skin, really look into charcoal as an ingredient. Activated charcoal is amazing, and that's why I wanted to create this face mask. All ingredients for this product are listed on my eBay and Etsy in like the description section if you want to look at them, but it's got like clay in it, clay powder, charcoal powder, it's got glycerin in here, tea tree oil, preservatives, a few other ingredients that I can't remember off the top of my head, but yeah, it's a great product and I love this. What you do is you apply this to your skin, leave it on for 10 minutes, it will have set by 10 minutes in, and then you remove it with warm water. It will leave your skin feeling very fresh, very clean, quite clear and regular use of this product. So I'd say two to three times a week, regular use of this product, you will have really nice, clear, soft skin. I would recommend moisturizing after using any clay face mask because I think to have and achieve clear, soft skin, you need to have a balance between oil stripping products like this and also hydrating products. Don't just drip out all the oils, you need to still be moisturizing. So yeah, this is my product, very, very happy with it. I really love this, I use this regularly myself. Like I said, I've created products that I myself love using, so um, I'd be a bit silly if I said I don't use this because I do. So this is my own personal one, by the way, if you're wondering. And also my face masks come with face mask brushes. So this is the brush that will come with your face mask. It just means that you don't have to use your hands to apply the product. It could get potentially quite messy. I just find that using a brush is a lot nicer because you can really kind of like distribute the product on your face like wherever you want it and you can be a little bit more specific. You can apply this all over your face or you can just pop it into the T-zone. Although this product is great for people with oily skin in particular, it is still good for any skin type. I just personally think that this is genuinely like perfect for oily skin people. But yeah, so this is product number one and this is £8.99. If I do say anything incorrect in this video, I will correct myself on the screen. 
Product number two is my cleansing balm. So this is my lemon scented cleansing balm. It has actually got the ingredients listed on the label here. Now this has been repackaged since it used to be um, in a bigger tin. It's a bit more of a thicker tin, but it's not quite as like wide as it used to be. And this is my favorite product that I have brought out myself. And I know that I might be a little bit biased saying that because this is my own like products, but this is my favorite product of my range. And I genuinely stand by that. I have altered the formula of this slightly, changing it over time. I think with products you have to kind of get that right balance. It has the same ingredients in it that it originally does, but different amounts of each one to get kind of like that formula where it's like melts on your skin. Now this, because it does contain oils and like shea butter, it has in there coconut oil. These are ingredients that do kind of get quite solid in the winter months. So don't keep this in a really cold environment. And if you do, take a little bit of it when you want to use it, just rub it into your hands, warm up the product, and then start to apply it onto your face. Now, this cleansing balm can actually be used directly onto your skin, even if you don't have makeup on. So I kind of market this as a makeup removal product, but you don't have to use it like that. You can use it onto bare skin. It doesn't have to have makeup on it. It can be there to remove your morning skincare. So if you've got SPF on, it can remove that. Or it can just be there as like a nice moisturizing cleanse. Cleansing balms, especially mine, is very softening to the skin. It's very moisturizing and hydrating and it makes your skin really, really nice and nourished and soft. And that's why I like this product because it can be used to remove makeup or it can be used to just cleanse your skin. So if you are using this as a makeup removal product like I do, take a little bit into your hand. I would recommend because it is winter to massage in your hand just to warm the product up and then just to start massaging into your face and into the skin and it will start to melt away your makeup. Cleansing balms are amazing for removing makeup because it generally just breaks down those makeup um, particles or it, it just breaks down your makeup on your skin and it means that it's so much like easier to remove, especially when it comes to eye makeup. What I would recommend to do is to just kind of rub gently across your mascara or your winged eyeliner and your eyebrows, that kind of thing. Once you have applied the product and you're confident that all of the makeup has kind of broken down, you can then take your flannel. Every single cleansing balm on my eBay and Etsy comes with a free flannel. That is something new this year. I did not used to do this. I didn't used to put face mask brushes in either um, with orders, but yeah, every single cleansing balm purchase comes with a free flannel. So if you was to buy five cleansing balms off me in one go, you would get five flannels. These are amazing. It means that you don't need to use face wipes. It means that what you can do is you can wash this and get it kind of nice and warm and damp. And then you can use it to just wipe away that cleansing balm that's kind of like already melted away your makeup. And then you can give this a good wash and reuse it the next day. It's reusable, it's made of cotton, it's super soft and it's a nice, good quality material. And um, so I'm really happy with this and I'm glad that this is an addition to my products and you don't have to pay more. The price of my cleansing balm is still the same as it was before. I just added this as a free extra. Sorry, the TV just being really weird lights like, just scared me a little. I feel like I'm out of breath doing this, I don't know why. Um, but yeah, so this is my cleansing balm. I'm really happy with it. I love it. It's a great product. It gives nice, clear, soft skin. And yeah, it's my favorite product I have. I use it every single day. I am obsessed. I literally love this product. So if there's one thing that I would recommend to get, then it's this, especially if you've not tried cleansing balms before because- Cleansing balms are game changers. Product number three is this. This is my tea tree oil. This is 30 ml. It comes in like a, um, a stopper bottle lid situation thing, <laughs> whatever you mean. Basically, it won't just pour straight out. It'll kind of drip into your hand. And basically, this is used for anything you want it to be used for, basically. It is an antiseptic, so it is kind of a clean substance, so you can use it for various different things. But I kind of more so market this as like a spot reduction product. So, this product does actually come with a free 
and reusable cotton pad. Now this is also new, a new thing I'm doing this year. Um, every single purchase of tea tree oils comes with one of these. Again, the price of the product did not increase because of this. This is a free addition and basically take a little bit of your tea tree oil, pop it onto the cotton pad and just kind of press it onto specific spots. And by the morning time, you will see that spot has reduced or gone completely. It is a spot reducing product and it is just a great thing to have in your cupboard if you get spots regularly or even if you just get them every so often. There is somebody that does buy these off me off eBay quite regularly. I'm a regular customer, they bought loads of these off me and I'm very happy to have that customer because they support me fully and I really like that. Any repeat customers I really love or any customers in general I love but yeah Thank you to that one person. Don't know if you watch my videos. Don't know who you are, but thank you. But yeah, this little guy is just pure tea tree oil. There's not that much more that I can say about this. This is my best seller out of all of these products. This sells um, the most. So yeah, now we have a little bit of a packet. Pa what am I on about? We have a little bit of a packaging change. So this is my detox clay face mask. Now, before, I don't know if you remember, it was actually in one of these. So you know the packaging that this comes in? Like a little pot. This powder was in here. So this is dry French clay. This is like the powder that you mix with water to create the face mask. A lot of people do sell this by itself um, so that you can mix up your own face mask and that's why I sell this as well. Now this is cheaper than my charcoal clay base mask, this is £6.99. You get a lot more product in it that you used to. Unfortunately I couldn't actually fit that much product into one of these for my dry clay so I wanted to change the packaging so that I could include more in here. So yeah it does fit a lot more in here, it's a smooth texture so it will blend really nicely like with water and it will just smooth straight onto your skin. Just take one to two teaspoons of this product, mix it with just a little bit of water, get the right consistency. The beauty with this is you can get it as thick or as thin as you would like. So it's quite an easy product to use and quite a nice product to use in that respect. So yeah, I just thought I would show you this. And again, this comes with a face mask brush as well, if you was wondering. Now we have the section of the video where I show you my new product, which launched just a couple of days ago. Now this is my Fresh Face by Georgie Carr Sheer Shine Lip Gloss. You get eight mil of product in here. And basically I did bring out a lip gloss before Christmas, a few months before Christmas, and it was a peach lip gloss. It was like a peachy color, so kind of like a pinky color. I have not discontinued that, but I've just stopped doing that for the time being because I really wanted to just do a clear lip gloss for this year to, to kind of start this year. I personally love just clear lip glosses. I will just wear them by themselves. I'll probably like line my lips with the lip liner and then just pop this straight on. And I genuinely love this so much. So this is a just a clear lip gloss. You just put it straight onto your skin. It has a vanilla -y scent to it. So it is um yeah it is a slight vanilla scent it's not too strong i didn't want to make it overpowering because when you've got products on your lips that's right underneath your nose you don't want to be smelling something really strong all day um so it's got the subtlest vanilla scent to it and a, a slight vanilla -y taste as well um you don't you can eat this it is um edible um but i don't know why you would but yeah it has to be edible if it's a lip product but yeah this is my new product i'm super super happy with it i'll leave all the information on the screen because as i'm filming this video i haven't actually launched this product yet so i'm not sure on the price or anything like that but all of the information should be on the screen at some point yeah i love this product i've been testing it for a while it makes your lips look shiny look plump it also has glycerin in here which gives hydration to your lips and it's got jojoba oil in it which is very hydrating so not only does this look nice on the lips but it's also moisturizing your lips at the same time so this is great for people with dry skin like if you get dry lips it will help to nourish your lips and if you don't this is also great so yeah i really love this and i'm super happy to be bringing this out just a fun fact about this particular lip gloss is that the labels are made from recycled um packaging so they are recycled labels and I think that's just nice. Um, I chose that because I think it's better to try and 
use where you can things that can be recycled or things that have been recycled because it just encourages like brands to do that a little bit more if you are purchasing those things um so yeah i'm really happy with this and if you want to go and check it out please click the link in the description because um yeah i love this so yeah just to let you know with every order you I will include like a business card and also a little thank you note. If you order through Etsy, you will get 10% off your next order after you place that first order. Whereas with eBay, it doesn't do that. So just kind of a little FYI. Um, sometimes, not all the time, but sometimes I will throw in a cheeky little sample. Um, so these um, are samples that I'm gonna add to my next few orders. These are samples of charcoal clay face masks. I don't always put samples in, but I do occasionally. And sometimes if you are a regular customer for my like repeat buyers, I do sometimes throw in a three product. So um, yeah, I like to say thank you to my regular customers by doing that because I do appreciate people continually supporting me. Right, so that is everything. I just wanted to show you literally all of my products so far to begin this year just so that you know a bit of information about them there is all the information about these products like actually written on ebay and etsy in the description box about them but yeah i just wanted to kind of show you them in this video and if you've got any questions about anything please leave it in the comments hopefully you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if you did and subscribe to see more videos i'm not sure what videos are coming next week but i think there is a weekly vlog and also a body shop related video Video, so stick around for that and um, thanks for watching and I will see you then bye